the inauguration of the Parry of St. John, Kenya. There are few organizations whose symbols have come to generically resemble their core activities. There is another group of people here today who I want to recognize. They are those members of St. John who recently were involved in helping out at the Westgate appalling incident. And when I continue to travel through the St. John world, that is one of the stories that I should be telling. Because the outstanding work which was done by St. John in the aftermath of those dreadful events is something which has gained prominence throughout the St. John world. After many years of admirable contribution in improving the lives of people in Kenya, the date was ripe for the elevation of the Kenyan branch of St. John from an association to a priory status. I constitute the Priory of Kenya of the most venerable order of the Hospital of St. John of Jerusalem. I direct that the instrument of constitution be placed in the custody of the Priory hereby created. The All Saints Cathedral in Nairobi was the venue of the inauguration of the Priory of St. John, Kenya. In the presence of President Uhuru Kenyatta and top government officials as well as foreign dignitaries, the Lord Prior of the Order of St. John, Professor Anthony Mellows, officiated the special ceremony to inaugurate the new priory. As a knight, the Honorable Major Marsden Madoka. The first prior, Major Marsden Madoka, Deputy Prior Paul Ndungu, were installed as Knights of the Order of St. John. Other postulants invested as commanders and officers included Professor Kiran Abat, Eliakim Masale, Lazaro Kimanga, Albert Ruturi, Thomas Odiambo, Ramesh Meta, Professor Anna Karani, Benson Oduor, Brigadier Peter Manyara, and Hussein Hafid. Let me begin by saying that I'm really delighted to join all of you today on this special occasion. As we all celebrate the elevation of St. John, Kenya, the St. John's Ambulance, as most people in Kenya know it, has a rich history of helping those of our people who are vulnerable. The support has indeed been welcome, as it does complement government initiatives to make life better for the vulnerable in our society. Members of the Order of St. John came as far as England, Wales, neighboring Uganda and South Africa to witness the inauguration ceremony of the new Priory of Kenya. The congregation were treated to a procession of uniformed members and listened to music by Kipawa Kenya. All Saints Cathedral Choir. While St. John still remains one of the most preferred charity organizations offering emergency services in Kenya, they have embarked on aggressive plans to expand their services to reach more vulnerable communities. Maternal health care, Highway emergency response, disaster preparedness and medical support to poor families are just a sample of their current projects. I am pleased to be involved with St. John's Ambulance as Chief Patron. Jumbo, jumbo. 